Hello everyone, I'm Alfonso Mora, I'm 27 years old. If I want to talk about my trajectory, first of all, I have to talk about my family. My mom Adriana, my father Juan, my brother Cesar, my brother Juan Carlos, my sister-in-law Nancy, and my two nephews. My trajectory starts at my university, where I got graduated five years ago. After that, I live in Santa Fe, New Mexico, and for other six months in Calgary, Canada. Two years ago, I took a certification program at Ipade Business School. My career at PepsiCo starts in Guadalajara plant. As soon as I entered in this company, I realized how important was this role for the company, but also how important was my job and my actions in the whole people that are working here in this company. Also, I have working in a mixing center, cereal plant, knowing the supply chain and working through that. Factories, willing warehousing, mixing centers, transport and fleet. Now I am manager of Morelos, Toluca and Sirius plant. I have six persons on my charge, but also I have the responsibility to improve the career in this company. My career expectations are to grow my business knowledge, mentor me in sales area. I would like to work in another country in order to see how do they business and teach them how we do business. I am truly proud to work in such an amazing company and I thank you for the opportunity. Hello, I am Alfonso Mora and I'm going to talk about Cable Pharmaceutical Business Case. I choose this business case because the problems that the case uh, shows are related to my actual job. Job performance, boss change, job terminations and communication to his clients. So let's see what is Cable Pharmaceutical. It is a very important company that factory medicine, but this medicine it just can be sold for a dentist or doctor recipe. This company has 400 workers and each worker or self-representative worker has 200 clients. So where is the problem? The director from the company says that they received certain number of letters from dentists, doctors and hospitals complaining about how can this company can fire a Bob Marshall. Very important guy for this subject. But it, this is not the problem. The problem is why the doctor, dentist and hospital get mad and had to go with the company? And who tell these persons, doctors, dentists and hospitals that Bob Marshall was fired in the way that they think? So let's see the solution. The company almost did the correct thing with Bob Marshall. They give them feedback. They wrote down the feedback and they tracked this feedback and he didn't improve his performance so the company decided to finish the relation. Until here I think they did the correct thing. But what I don't think that when Bob Marshall asked to speak with his second level manager, the second level says, you know I think your boss did the correct thing, we have nothing to speak. That is where Bob Marshall get angry and this is where Bob Marshall go with his all clients, dentists, doctors and hospitals to tell them that the company didn't end the relation good. So my solution of this business case was to his second level manager receive Bob Marshall, hear what he has to say and tell them why the company took this decision. Just little thing we will change the whole business case. The complementary solution is if the company knows that he's going to fire an employee, the company has to go with his clients, doctor, dentists and hospitals and tell them, you know, you know Bob Marshall, we are going to fire because he did this and this. But also, he, here is the new employee that he's going to give you support in your cells and he's going to visit you. With these two change, the whole case will be different. We won't have this problem because the company will hear the employee that he was fired and he will get so easy and the company will go with his client. So this is my solution for this business case.